Hello my children, today we will read together Cinderella play. Here we have a picture of Cinderella. Let's know the characters in this play. Here we have the cast or the characters, the people who are acting in this play. The first character we have, the narrator. Narrator means the person who tells us the story. Sometimes your grandmom or your grandfather sits with you and tells your story, yes? So, the narrator means the person who tells the story. Here we have Cinderella. Yes, who is Cinderella? Cinderella is a girl, lives with her stepmother. This is the stepmother. What the meaning of stepmother? Stepmother is the father's wife, not your mother. So if your father married another one, so we call her stepmother. This stepmother, yes, has two daughters. Yes, we call them stepsister. So this one, stepsister one, stepsister one. Two. So, stepsister is the stepmother's daughter. Okay? So, the stepmother has two daughters. We call them stepsisters. Yes. Then we have fairy. Yes. This woman is a fairy. A fairy is a magician or supernatural one. Super. Supernatural one that can make magic. Here we have the messenger. Messenger means a person who carries messages. Messenger, a person who carries messages. We have the prince. The prince is the king's son. And the guests at the dance. That means the party. The guests means the people who attend the party. People attending the party, we call them the guests. Now, you know all characters in the story. I want you to imagine the actions and the events. Let's read the story together. The narrator. Once upon a time, a lovely girl with the name Cinderella lived with her stepmother and stepsisters. They were very lazy and they treated Cinderella badly. Stepmother? Cinderella! Did you make our beds? Cinderella, they are almost ready. Stepsister one. Good. We need to have our morning nap. Stepsister two. And make our lunch. We are going to want it when we wake up. Narrator, one day, messenger came to the door. Messenger, there is going to be a dance at the palace. The prince is inviting everyone. Stepsisters, how exciting! The stepmother said, we must all get new dresses. Stepsister one. And new slippers. Cinderella said, May I go to the dance? Stepsister one. What are you going to wear? Stepsister two. And just look at your hair. Stepmother. No. You may not go to the dance. Narrator. 
on the night of the dance, Cinderella helped her stepsisters and stepmothers to get ready. When they finally left, she sat and cried. Cinderella, oh, I want to go to the dance too. Narrator, Cinderella knew that her stepsisters didn't like her because she was prettier than they were, and her stepmother never bought her nice clothes or did her hair. Cinderella, but how can I go to the dance? Looking like this. Let's learn some new words together. Palace. Palace here, the place where king prince live. Palace. Dance or party. Dance. Pretty means beautiful. Pretty. Make the bed. After you get up, you make your bed. Slippers. Slippers, cry, cry. Let's answer some questions. Number one, who did Cinderella live with? Yes, did she live with her father? With her mother? No, Cinderella lived with her stepmother and stepsisters. Number two. How were Cinderella's stepsisters? They were active? Clever? No, they were lazy. They don't want to do anything. Number three. How did Cinderella's stepsisters treat her? Yes. Huh, they were polite? No, they were not polite. They treated her very badly. Number four, who came to the door one day? Who came to tell them about the invitation, the dance? Yes, a messenger came to the door. Why did the messenger come to the door? To tell them about the dance in the prince's palace. Yes. Number six, what did Cinderella's stepmother want to attend the dance? Huh? She wants to get what to attend the dance? Yes, she wanted to get new dresses huh? and new slippers. Yes, new dresses and slippers. Very good. Number seven. Why did Cinderella's stepmother refuse to take her to the dance? Why well, didn't accept to take her to the dance? Huh? Because she didn't have new dress to wear and her hair was messy. Yes. Number eight. Why did Cinderella cry? Do you remember this? Why she cried? Because, huh? Yes, she stayed alone at home and... She didn't go to the dance. She wants to go to the dance and her stepmother refused. This is why she cried. Number nine. Why didn't Cinderella's stepmother and stepsister like her? Why they treat her badly like this? Why they don't like her? You know the reason? Huh? Because she was prettier than them. She was more beautiful than them. Excellent. Narrator. On the night of the dance, Cinderella helped her stepsisters and stepmothers to get ready. When they finally left, she sat and cried. Cinderella, oh, I want to go to the dance too.